guys, so today I'm going to be doing a haul for you. I haven't done a haul in a really long time, I feel like, anyways, it's been a while. So I just have a small little drugstore haul with some things that I recently picked up. Some skincare, nail polish, my FIFs this month, and then, yeah, just a couple other little random goodies. So first thing I want to start with is something that isn't from the drugstore, but it is my new glasses. And um, I purchased these, I don't know, probably like the beginning of school. So probably like two, three weeks ago, um, and I got, well, I purchased them a while, and then I got them. They're by the brand, well, they're um, from this website called Select Specs, and I'm not promoted or anything from them. They, I mean, I purchased them when, even when I was in high school, and they sell a bunch of different prescription glasses, like really high-end to like Ray-Ban, Dolce & Gabbana, all that kind of stuff for really affordable prices, and then they sell like starter glasses for as little as $6 with your lenses and everything included, and if you're a glasses person, you know how expensive it can be to get a new pair of glasses, and all I wanted was a simple pair of glasses that I could wear because I never took my contacts out because my glasses weren't my right prescription so now I'm so good about it and I take them out every single night I can't wait to put on my glasses and um, I got this full set of glasses for $20 everything included shipping everything um, so they make me look super nerdy and I really can't even see because I have contacts on with my glasses on but they're just tortoise shell basic standard nerdy looking glasses and I really recommend if you guys are looking for like cheaper glasses um, or even like nicer glasses check out that website I'll have it linked down below it's amazing I ordered my Dolce & Gabbana ones off of there when I was in high school and then I just ordered those so that I didn't care if like I fall asleep with them on like watching a movie or something they like break anything like that it's just really nice to have a pair of cheap glasses so that's the first thing I wanted to mention and then I'm gonna go ahead and mention the one piece of clothing that I got um, I am going to the USF football game. I don't know who it's against, but it is this Saturday. Um, well, you've probably, it's probably already passed by the time I post this, but it was on Saturday. And I don't go to USF, but um, I go to a school next to it, UT. And um, I'm going to the USF football game with a bunch of friends, so I wanted to pick up, see if I could pick up a shirt. If not, I didn't like it, it was no big deal, but I saw one that was really cute. My friend Lisette told me they had them at Walmart, and I got this one, it's a large, but it fits really nice, and it was $14.97, and it's kind of like a meshy material up here, a v-neck, and then kind of like, almost like a sports jersey type of thing. So I thought this was really, really cute, it just says University of Florida, South Florida, just basic and I thought it would look really cute with just some jean shorts or something like that just fun and um, lightweight so I was really excited about that so check out Walmart because they even have UT stuff there they carry a bunch of different stuff so if like you're looking for just cute lo college loungewear and don't want to spend like the price that you know is like Nike makes it or whatever definitely check out Walmart anyways let's go ahead and get in with the rest of the haul um, first I'm going to start with the two nail polishes that I got. The um, first one I want to talk about is one that my mom actually sent me, so thank you mommy if you're watching this. It's called, it's Essie's, their new fall collection, it's called For the Twill of It. She actually ripped off the sticker, which drives me crazy, but I know the name. And it's kind of like a duochrome color, it's like gray and purple and green and Nah, I don't know, just amazingness. So I'm really excited to try this. I'm worried that it's going to be sheer, but no, it actually looks pretty opaque. So I'm really excited to try this. It's going to be perfect for the fall time. It reminds me a lot of Essie's Dive Bar, but more like rich colors. Well, Dive Bar is like blue and greens, but so pretty. Love Essie's Geochromes. And then I also got just a gold chunky glitter nail polish in this. I've been looking for a gold chunky glitter forever, and Milani has always sold out of this at my drugstore. I love Milani glitter polishes. They're just really nice. They're nothing like super opaque or anything, but they just are good. I just really, really like them. So um, this is called 351 Gold, obviously. It's just a chunky gold glitter. Pretty basic, but I thought this would be nice because USF's colors are green and gold so I figured I could paint my nails with gold nail polish and I think it looks really pretty with like a baby pink and then a gold accent nail. It's really really nice. So excited about that. I'm really happy that I found that. It was like shoved in the back. I was like digging to get it. And then I picked up two foundations for my FIFs this month and the first one you guys have already seen my FIF. If you haven't I will link it down below. FIF stands for First Impression Friday. I do it every Friday and um, I pick a new foundation. This month was foundations is foundations and I checked I tried the Revlon um, nearly naked I'm in the color 360 fresh beige I think I should have gone up a color um, but yeah if you want to check out my first impression about that check that video will be linked down below and for my final thoughts check at the end of the month for that so 
that's the first one I picked up. And then the other one I picked up was um, the CoverGirl Outlast Stay Fabulous 857. This is the foundation and sunscreen. It's in the color Golden Tan. And I think this might be too dark, but I don't know. <laughs> we'll see. But I like it. It's in a pump, and I haven't used it yet. So that, it, but it will be up by the time you watch this. So I will link that FIF down below as well so you can check it out and see my first impressions on this as well as my final thoughts at the end of the month. I still have one more FIF to buy, so we'll see which one I pick. And then the last bits of makeup I picked up were two Wet n Wild blushes. I picked up um, Heather Silk and Mellow Wine because I've been using pearlescent pink like all month all month it's like halfway through the month but halfway through the month for the past like two three weeks I've been using pearlescent pink and I've loved it so I picked up some richer colors so these are really pigmented really nice but these are matte and not shimmery like pearlescent pink so love these they are like two bucks amazing deal okay and then for skincare we're almost finished up here I picked up just the astringent just the um, store brand deep cleaning astringent this is comparable to the clean and clear I use this all the time I go through it so fast and I actually like the top on this one better than the one that the other one's like way bigger and I end up pouring so much out so this one's smaller and I like it better so um, it does the same thing I just like the container of this a lot better than the um, clean and clear one and then I picked up this lotion this is the Neutrogena Rapid Clear Acne Defense Face Lotion. I think this will be really nice for helping kind of like keep my pores unclogged throughout the day when I'm wearing makeup. So I'm pretty excited to try this. Holly Anna Re raves about this and says it's amazing. So um, I thought that I would try it. It's oil free, lightweight, maximum strength, all that good jazz. And it says it does not clog pores, that non comedogenic whatever word I can't say. So that's what I thought it would be nice for. So I'm excited to check this out and I'm gonna be doing a morning and night care night routine school routine so I'm sure that'll be in there if I like it and then the last thing I picked up was just this um oh shoot she didn't use my little coupon on oh, nuts I could have used it oh well I can get another one if I want it anyways I got the plus white five minute prim premier whitening system I heard all about this from Leanne says she's amazing link will be down below if you have not checked her out but she uses this and she really likes it so I thought that I would try it. And um, yeah, I ran out of my other whitening, my Go White pen that ran out. So I haven't purchased anything since that. And I've been drinking coffee like nobody's business. So I thought I would pick this up. So I'll let you guys know what I think about this. I'm sure in a favorites video. So that is all of my haul that I've done recently, mostly today, honestly. And um, yeah, because I had a test for business law. And once I was done with business law, I was like, you know what? I'm going to go shopping, a little bit of shopping. So that's what I did. And then I ran back and filmed a haul. So anyways, guys, I hope you all are having a great day and have an amazing weekend. It'll probably be past the weekend. Amazing week because I'm going to be posting this next week. I have to film ahead so much because of school. So anyways, I hope you all enjoyed this video. Let me know what you've picked up recently. And if you're excited about FIFs. And also, if you want to see my morning and nighttime school routine thing, I'm excited about filming that. It's just a lot of work, but I will find time, I swear. So I love you guys. I hope you all are doing well, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.